receive the Holy Spirit, eight ways to get more of God's Spirit, an interpretation of the New Testament of the Holy Bible. 1. Repent and be baptized. Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, for the forgiveness of your sins, and you will receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. 2. This is for Jews. John baptized with the baptism of repentance, telling the people to believe in the one who was to come after him, that is, Jesus. On hearing this, they were baptized in the name of the Lord Jesus. And when Paul had laid his hands on them, the Holy Spirit came on them. And for Gentiles, the Holy Spirit fell on all who heard the word. The gift of the Holy Spirit was poured out even on the Gentiles, and Peter commanded them to be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. Two, obey God rather than men. We must obey God rather than men. The God of our fathers raised Jesus, whom you killed by hanging him on a tree and we are witnesses to these things, and so is the Holy Spirit, whom God has given to those who obey him. 3. Believe God's promises. May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing, so that by the power of the Holy Spirit you may abound in hope Sanctify it by the Holy Spirit. 4. Ask the Father. For everyone who asks receives, and the one who seeks finds, and to the one who knocks it will be opened. If you know how to give good gifts to your children, how much more will the Heavenly Father give the Holy Spirit to those who ask Him? Five, endure suffering. The gospel must first be proclaimed to all nations. And when they bring you to trial and deliver you over, do not be anxious beforehand what you are to say, but say whatever is given you in that hour, for it is not you who speak, but the Holy Spirit. Endurance produces character, and character produces hope, and hope does not put us to shame, because God's love has been poured into our hearts through the Holy Spirit who has been given to us. 6. Resist temptation. This is the will of God, your sanctification, that you abstain from sexual immorality. Whoever disregards this disregards not man but God, who gives his Holy Spirit to you. Do not get drunk with wine, for that is debauchery, but be filled with the Spirit, addressing one another in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, singing and making melody to the Lord with your heart. 7. Worship Together when the day of Pentecost arrived, they were all together in one place, and they were all filled with the Holy Spirit, and began to speak in other tongues, as the Spirit gave them utterance. When they had prayed, the place in which they were gathered together was shaken, and they were all filled with the Holy Spirit, and continued to speak the word of God with boldness. 8. Serve one another. To each is given the manifestation of the Spirit for the common good. All these are empowered by one and the same Spirit, who apportions to each one individually as he wills. For in one Spirit we were all baptized into one body, 
Jews or Greeks, slaves or free, and all were made to drink of one spirit.